This contest is set for one fall with a 20 minute time limit. Approaching the ring first, from Calabasas, California, Maddie Renkowski. Maddie Renkowski making her AEW debut. Calabasas, California, Taz. Right down the road from you. A huh. little further up the road. So it's three hours away. Oh, it's good. no, it's like six in, in traffic. It's oh, terrible. Maybe you want to drive up there and go do some cardio at the gym with Maddie. It's how you do with cardio with all the talent. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's there. <laughs> or I could just do it in my garage. That's an option. <laughs> Save and up gas. her opponent, she's originally from Moscow, Russia. Legit Layla Hirsch. Legit Layla Hirsch making her return here tonight to AEW Dark. Layla, high school wrestling standout in the state of New Jersey. And uh, that folk style wrestling background of Hirsch on full display every time we've seen her test, she uses it to great effect. She sure does, she has excellent balance. She's good explosive quickness on takedowns. You know, the way she inserts, how quick she inserts. Go for a high crotch to take someone down or a quick go behind, let's see. She got, you know, you look at Layla, she's not as tall as a lot of the competitors, which is a, there's that, oh, it's a double, double leg. That's a beautiful double leg right there. To the point, into an attempt of a Juji Katami across Ombre. Immediately takes down Maddie Rankowski. Rankowski, oh. I think, sorry again. I realized she was in deep, uh, deep you know what, Tess. Yeah, man, and that's what I was fixing to say, you know, it's like, Maddie's got a big height advantage, as some would think it's an advantage, but it's not when you are not as tall as a wrestler. We saw Hirsch was able to just slip under that that's collar and elbow tie-up. She has an advantage. I did that my whole career. When you don't have the height, you use that to an advantage, and I think Layla does that really well, especially I think she'll do that against someone like Maddie here because she's got this height thing going on. Layla doing a little, little bit of hand fighting there. T takes control of that left wrist of Maddie Rinkowski. Yeah, she don't rush into anything. And, oh, Maddie, what she's got in mind, a little roll up, a little kip up. Oh, Layla Hirsch just sits down, looking for that cross arm breaker. Yeah, it's smart by Maddie, what she's doing. She's gripping her own hand with a nest lock. But you, if Layla was able to, okay, it was smart to get the ropes. If she was able to kick that bicep to break that grip and extend that arm, you tear a bicep, you could see that Maddie's in a lot of pain here. Yeah, already, even even with uh, the fact that Layla Hirsch did not have it cinched completely in. Oh, rolls through and comes in, but uh, bypassed there by Layla Hirsch. Oh, nice. Drop kick, though, by Rinkowski. I like that running drop kick. You don't see, you have a, you know, you don't see that much, the run, ex Calvino, you know, the deal, the running drop kick with the one foot, that yeah. quickness like that. And when you're taller, like Maddie, it's a little tougher to do a drop kick to someone who's not as tall, like Layla. But Rinkowski doing a good job. Those, uh, those kicks to the kidneys of Layla Hirsch. But, oh, the knee lift to the midsection stops Layla in her tracks. You can see Layla Hirsch just gasping for breath. Yeah, and look at, that, look at the intensity right here by Maddie. The mean, mean young lady, bringing it. She knows a win here would do wonders for her career in AEW. Her yeah, a lot of buzz on Layla Hirsch, oh. legit Layla Hir Hirsch for sure. I mean, a lot of people, big fans of hers, and there's a lot, a lot to like in Layla Hirsch. So to your point, for Maddie, if she gets a win here, it's a big, big victory. Just talk a lot of, yes, a lot of trash. Talking a lot of stuff, but so far backing it up, Taz. Very lackadaisical Ugh. cover there. He took the words out of my mouth. Yeah, you know, I think she got a little bit of ahead of ahead of herself, Maddie. She should have went in a little quicker, more aggressively. You have someone with the amateur credentials of Layla, and you have them down. You want to zone in for the win. And you can see Layla Hirsch using her hands to pull the grip of uh, uh, to keep that that form of Maddie Rankowski off of her off of her throat. And now, broke her down. Kicked her in the front of the quad, broke her down. Oh, maybe go for a German. Oh! Yeah. Nicely done. Vaulting off the back into perfect position. One, two, no! Again, you know, when your hips are under your opponent, right, that's a big advantage for a suplex. And Layla just got even deeper underneath Maddie, and that German was excellent. Layla Hirsch charges in. Renkowski counters with the back. Slide, finally one, two, no. Good job by referee Bryce Renberg realizing not to just start counting. He waited for the shoulders to be down. Oh! oh. oh. Yeah. Just planted. Ah, that's a mistake. Layla Hurst, one, two. Yeah, she could have got a win. I mean, she just all she has to do is just apply a half Nelson 
to turn Layla instead of pulling her over. That slows down the cover. Yeah, that slows you're, down you're the literally, literally wasting precious seconds yeah. there. Yep. Went for the, the pump kick, but Hirsch. Oh! Nice. And now. Got that on bar in. Into the cross arm breaker. Extended that Juju Katami is extended. Got a tap. And now yeah. forcing Renkowski to tap out. The winner of this match, legit Layla Hirsch. It's not a fancy on bar. It's been used a lot in MMA and pro wrestling for a lot of years now. Uh, in the great sport of judo, I mean, it's been used for decades upon decades, and it's it's a phenomenal hold. But Tez, I mean, once you get that locked in, your opponent, uh, it's it's th that flight or f fight yeah. or flight reflex just kicks in. Correct. And there's different things you do with your legs. She decided to go hamstrings across the throat and chest. Uh, back in the day, I did it. I put my shin across the head and my other leg across the chest. There's different ways to do it. But as long as you get the bicep Excalibur extended, as you know, that's how you get that tap out win. She got the tap out. She got the victory. Legit Layla Hirsch. I've been going die hard. How's your back? It's a little bit sore. Oh my God. <laughs> What's up? I want to talk about wrestling with the week. Whatever we have interest in, we're going to chop it up. Did you get the PS5? Uh, Scorpio Sky and myself, James Willems. <laughs> we're going to be talking about video games. We're going to be talking about pop culture. Have you seen the New York Subway Rat Man? What? <laughs> we're going to be recapping AEW. We're basically going to be talking about the week. Make sure you subscribe now.